Anyway guys, welcome back to another video. It is your boy, Dynamic Gaming, and today we're going to be reviewing X-Force. It is made by my friend A9R, and this is honestly a really sick mod. You know, Dynamic Mods is the best menu, but this is probably the second best menu. Uh, it is paid, but it is super undetected. It is honestly crazy. So anyway guys, um, thank you for clicking on this video, and let's get right into it. Why does it always have to be night when I'm recording? Like, I mean, it's pretty Sigma, but anyway, so this is the menu. It is honestly pretty Sigma. Like, look at this. Pretty fire. You have a disconnect button. So let's start off. Settings, we have menu settings, movement settings, and projectile settings. Menu settings, we have right hand, just makes it right hand. You have FPS counter, just d disables the FPS counter, counter. And then uh, disconnect button, just disables the disconnect button. Uh, modded board, so we have to go up to stump. So with it on, it just changes it to X4s. This menu is in beta, which it is. And then user agreement, welcome buyer, I'm in, I know I'm not responsible. But after that, I'm going to exit it. Next up, we have movement settings. So there's no movement settings. I told you it's in beta. Projectile settings, there's no projectile settings. So that was settings. Next up, we have anti-report fully undetected. So if somebody were to report you, you wouldn't get reported. So next up, we have basic mods. We have platforms. These are really nice platforms. Pretty Sigma. Cool. Teleport gun. I really like this teleport gun. I mean, look at that. Is that not cool? And then you can just bim over there. Really accurate too. Look at that. Right over there. Boom. Over there. It's crazy. Next up we have fly. It's just A. And it's fly. Pretty Sigma. And it's pretty fast. Uh, we have steam long arms. Just gives you bendable steam long arms. Um, pretty good. I'm going to keep them on for the rest of the video. Speed boost. It's just a nice, nice, nice Sigma speed boost. Let's see how... It, it's pretty jumpy. I think it's pretty detectable. Like people would know in a comp. But it is pretty good. It is pretty good. Next up, we have rig mods. So we have ghost monkey. Uh, ghost monkey is not working. Invis monkey. I think these are broken at the moment. Next up, we have fun mods. There are no fun mods. It's not that fun. Um, next up, we have tag all. So uh, it's undetected tag all. Pretty sigma. Pretty cool. Uh, next up, we have visual mods. So we have box CSP. Which puts a box around the player. Sphere SP is just a spear. Uh, sphere. I don't know what uni Unity ESP is. I don't know. Beacons just puts a beacon, shams, and tracers. That's it for visual. Projectile, there are no projectile mods. And then overpower mods. This is honestly insane. Crash all, you have to use anti band. Th yeah, anti band is yeah, anti band is working. Then you have kick all, but everyone has to be in stomp, and I think you have to be in a private. And then disable net. Okay, this is I've never seen this on a menu. That is that is honestly a really cool. Like disable network triggers all. That's really cool. And then you have trap stomp, it just trap stomp, but you have to have anti ban on. So, and that's basically it for X4, so let's get to the outro. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I know it was a short one, but it was pretty good. I really like this menu. You should get it too. It, it, and, it, and it's really cheap. It's like super cheap. I think it's a really good menu. There's more things to come to the menu. They're updating it every single day. It's honestly insane. Make sure to go join his Discord and my Discord server because we are almost at 1,500 members. So anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Woo! <laughs>